So am I ever gonna look in there or just, I'm just gonna Well, however it? you want, however okay. you want. You're like, just look them in the eyes all the time. That's what I do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but you're the host. Keep the on. Yeah. I'm like, and when I ask you a question, I don't even break it. <laughs> <laughs> One eye goes there. <laughs> That's fine. Um, I'm here with the superstar, Sarah Backman. Hey, welcome hey. to Istanbul again. Thank you. You were here for the first event. Yes, two and a half years ago now. Yeah. Yeah. That, that was, we didn't expect it would become this. It took, yeah, it took over. It, it definitely took over. I remember we were in Yalova, right? Mm -hmm. uh, in Engin City. Mm -hmm. And we did the live stream. And I remember I had a computer and mm -hmm. I was doing the commentating mm -hmm. like this because we didn't have microphone. We didn't think, right? Yeah. We, yeah. we just, and I think what it was, 100 20,000 live views or yeah. something. Yeah. It was insane. So we know, oh, okay. Yeah. Something. There's is an there. audience. Yeah. Yeah. That time you were very successful, right? Yeah. Yeah. Did I you, won Irina? against Irina Dreyeva. Yeah. Um, then you pulled a few times on, uh, not few times, but you pulled King of Table, mm -hmm. right? And now you're coming back. Mm -hmm. You have a very big match, very tough opponent. Yeah, it's huge. Um, so I was only to Amy last week and I hope to see Egle. She, I thought she just might come to the competition or something, but she didn't come. So I have no idea mm. what kind of shape she is. Mm. Yeah. Like I have heard, like since we talked, I heard more people saying like, oh, Sarah's in killer shape. She's coming to destroy. Ooh. You. Me? Yes, you. Oh, <laughs> like, really? Oh, yes, Me? you. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So that's crazy to me because Egle to me is like everything, mm. right? That she yeah. lost to Gabby was like a... It shocked? was shocked. Yeah. I was shocked. Yeah. Um, super happy for Gabby because I know how bad she wanted that. Um, but to me, like, I have never beaten Eglet. I've never even been close to mm. beating Eglet, right? Now, last time we went against each other was 11 years ago. And That's a long so, time. You know, Very I'm, long time. I'm older. I'm heavier. Like, and she's smaller. Yeah. She's also older. Way yeah. older. <laughs> No way older. No, you know, but you know, since the yeah. 11 years. 11 years is 11 years, yeah, <laughs> years. for everybody. Yeah, yeah, for me too, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, uh, so how do you feel right now coming in? Uh, of course, you're tired from the road, mm -hmm. but preparation, everything. Yeah, how was it? Yeah, I feel good. Uh, mentally, this is what I've been wanting. Um, I was dodging it. Engin has been trying for a long time to make this happen. And I was like, nah, yeah. I don't feel ready. I don't feel ready. But then recently, like six months ago, my mindset shifted and I was like, you know what? I got to take the chance, yeah. you know, like we're not getting younger. Like yeah. this is it, like win or yeah. lose. Like I just want this opportunity. I want to see where I'm at. And uh, she would be, it would be incredible for me if I pulled this off and won. It would mean so much to me. Oh, we, we, I know you're very passionate about yeah. this sport. So this is why like, of course, you like. I think um, I talked with Dennis, and uh, when he got injured, right, uh, 2019, he had health problems. Not injured, but health problems, right? He said uh, when he wanted to come back, everyone was al already putting him right there mm -hmm. at the top of the Everest, mm -hmm. right? He's right there, mm -hmm. but he's like, I know I'm not, right? Yeah. But I don't know where am I. He's like, and I was afraid, I was afraid. He's like, but then I took a step forward. Mm -hmm. John, now Devon, mm -hmm. right? Um, I don't think you should be scared from anyone, right? Yeah. And I'm just thinking, what's the worst thing can happen? You lose, yeah. right? Then you train and you win, yeah. right? Yeah. It's exactly. This is your mindset now? Yes. I love it. Yes. That's what we want. Yes. Yeah. Yes. We want more, more. Exactly. And it's a contribution back to arm wrestling, you know, because mm -hmm. when I look at East versus West, or, you know, when I buy the pay-per-view as a fan, I don't look down on the people that lose. They're still my friends. They're still... Elite athletes, yeah. you know, fifty percent gonna lose. Yeah, right? that's the thing. Yeah, yeah. There's no draws yeah, about this. Yeah, there, there has never yeah. been a draw, right? Yeah. So yeah, I'm I'm totally in the game now. I want to play the game. So let's go. Yeah, Egle is the first step. Uh, you won't get back to Gabi eventually, yes. right? And see your chances maybe against Barbora if yes. that is possible. Yes. So that that's the future. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Well, I said like so many times, it's very lonely at the top of female armor, yeah, as know. it is at the top of men's armor yes, as well, right? Yes. There's not, you, you, you don't know who, right, or what. Um, 
there's also another Swede pulling on a card, mm -hmm. which I think we don't know. Like, Fia is incredibly strong. Yep. She, this year, she beat world, became world champion at yep. 65 kilos, mm -hmm. and she qualified for world nomad games. Mm -hmm. No nomad games, but world combat games. Combat games. In 80 kilo class, mm -hmm. 15 kilos up. Yeah. And beat everyone. Yeah. Easy. She's fearless. I love that about Fia. She do not stop. Yeah. And like win or lose, like she's a huge inspiration for all of us for uh, female arm wrestling. Um, she don't care if you're heavier or not, and uh, that's how you grow as an athlete. And like the opponents will be fewer and fewer the more you compete. So I love that she's just challenging herself on this one. Because her opponent Rosa, uh, I think, has been a silver medalist in world. So yeah. she's at the top of super heavyweight division. If if Fia beats her. I think she steps into this class together with you, Gabby Eglin. Yes. Right? Oh my God, I'm totally for it. I, I think that would be awesome. W would you, or it's off the table that you would pull each other? Or you? I'm I'm game. I, yeah, I'm game. If that happens, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. If she wants it, I'm. But I'm I'm probably not gonna come down. You know, 80 yeah. kilo is the lowest I will go. Yeah. Like I'm struggling right now <laughs> to come down to 80 kilo. Like I still have to cut a couple kilos. You're just tired. That's 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 what people say when they're tired. It's yeah. It's gonna be easy. Don't worry. Yeah. 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 It's really hot here. Yeah. It's not. No. <laughs> How hot is was in Florida? Florida, I don't know. It's what like 28, 30 degrees. Okay, this is minus 10. No. <laughs> no, minus 10 from that. So 20. <laughs> it's not that bad. Oh. Okay. Um, you have been here. I don't know. Did you met Dennis or Devon already? Or no. No, you just went straight to the sign. Yes, I just got here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so uh, you'll you'll see and you'll see the feel of the room when you see it all. Oh my goodness! Um, has anything in your mind changed about the match? Who's who's the winner, or how do you look at it? With Devon? Yeah, and Devin. Dennis. I I still believe in Devon. Mm. Yeah, yeah. My I, I it's not going to be easy for anybody, but I think Devon will finally pull it off. Like it, it's his, it's his, uh, it's his time, you it's know. His, maybe it's his destiny. Yeah, it's right. thirty plus years, you know. It now this is it for him. Yeah. I it's, love to see it. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> yeah. Doesn't matter what. Doesn't I matter. Think. Doesn't matter what I think. It's. Uh, I just. Uh, I love to hear thoughts because everyone has their own. A lot of people said like, "There's no chance for." Uh, like one of them were eleven seconds short. Eleven said, "There's." Is like I would love if Dennis would win because then it opens door Levin versus Dennis, mm -hmm. right? I said, but there's no chance he's gonna win. He's like zero, right? And then some people said like, oh, there's no chance Devon will even move him, right? So we have yeah. everyone's kind of cut in yeah. half. I oh love it. Yeah, it's gonna be very interesting. <laughs> yeah, uh, there's uh, there's of course uh, a lot of more matches. John Berzank and and, and Sasha. Sasha. Yeah. yeah, John is he's gonna cut Cutting. down to ninety five. Yep. Do you think uh, it makes it harder for him? Like uh, at 105, he looked very, very mm -hmm. strong. But at 95, and if you had to cut, that's a that's a big cut, you know. But it's John Bersink. Um I think he's he loves the challenge. Like he don't have to prove anything to anybody. So yeah. like, why not struggle a little bit, you know? <laughs> you know, sprinkle a little, you know, I, seasoning. I, I think if if John struggles, he's serious, mm -hmm. right? Because John would say, they were like, uh, we're going to make a weight cut, like weight cap and something. He's like, ah, no need, mm -hmm. right? But now he's like, if he's cutting down, I, I can't wait to meet John. See see this John, because I just saw him in King of the Table and he looked he looked fierce and strong yeah. against Floyd Water and that was yeah. impressive. Um, this card is looking like it could be, uh, there was, I think, two cards ago situation where West didn't win a single match. Mm. West is looking really good on this card. I know. Right? Yeah. Uh, there's a chance, three new champs there. Yeah. Yeah. Todd and Kidigali. Yeah. Are you, of course, you're team Todd, but do you think realistically <sighs> he has a chance? Oh, it's one of those matches that it's like, you really don't, I, I really don't know. I, I can't, you know. I. You, you it, see them both winning, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah I'm not going to be shocked if either one wins. Um, I really hope my teammate Todd wins, but uh, Ungarbaev, I don't know, he's just, just the way he lives over there mm. in Kazakhstan and he's like king of this village and the school and he's such a celebrity over there and um, like his life is 100% arm wrestling, yeah. you know, I think that speaks a lot of volume, but again, it's Todd Hutchings, so... <laughs> 
I don't know. It's going to be so interesting to see Saturday what's going to happen. Mm. So it doesn't matter what the outcome, we're going to see a lot more of Sarah Backman? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Yeah, you're ready to take on. I'm ready. Like, yeah. I bring it. Yeah. Yeah, bring it. Bring it. Friday. Oh, sorry. Saturday, 11th of November, East West West End. Link is in description. Sarah Backman.